update your iPod to 3.1.2. Um, this is with a jailbroken iPod, or really for any firmware for that matter, uh, without losing all your city apps. And uh, one of the most annoying things about updating is obviously we lose all our city apps, and those are things we've installed via Cydia and hacks and everything. Um, but today I'm going to show you how to um, get your iPod to update and be able to resync all your apps that you've downloaded in Cydia to it. Um, make sure if you haven't already, download Rock. It's from Cydia. It's under Big Boss Apps. It um, is basically like Cydia, but it's about 50 bajillion times faster, um, and it loads so quickly. Um, and I'll show you just how fast it loads. Um, you notice Cydia takes forever to load and then reload. And um, if you see at the bottom, Rock will start fetching updates. It takes about 30 seconds to a minute to um, update. And when you're installing apps, you can actually... Um, and it's done already. Um, but uh, you can actually use it while you're installing apps. So what you're going to want to do is go and to search and search for APT and just hit search. And what we have here, right here, is APT Backup. So just click on that, install it, and um, it'll. you can go back to your home screen and it should show up there. And I'll just go to it now. And you can see right here we have APT Backup. So we'll just open that. And um, you can see we have Backup and Restore. So let's just hit the Backup button right there. And it's going to take a few seconds to back up, but then you'll be done. Alright, so you're done with your iPod. Just minimize that. <laughs> you probably won't have to minimize it, but I'm using BNC. And open iTunes, connect your iPod, and you're going to right-click on your iPod and hit Backup. Uh, your iPod's going to start syncing, and uh, as soon as it's done, you're ready to go. What this does is it creates a list of Cydia apps. Um, and as soon as you back your iPod up, it's stored with the backup file. And when you update your iPod and jailbreak it again, you can reinstall um, the program APT Restore or Back APT Backup, and um, then just reinstall all the files again. It's really easy. It does it all for you. See, it says copying EPW Hall, and that's what it's going to do each time you back up, or each time you make a backup of all your apps. Okay, so let's go ahead. We can start the process of jailbreaking. What I'm going to do is hit update, and uh, I'll get back to you guys when it has updated. Okay, so now that the iPod is jailbroken, you can't see anymore because I don't have VNC installed on it anymore. But what you're going to want to do is go to this website, which is blackrain.com, and instead of an I, there's a 1. Download Black Rain for e either operating system, whatever you have. And we're going to hit Make It Rain. And it's going to make the device into recovery mode. If you've ever jailbroken, you'll know what I'm talking about. Uh, if you haven't, it'll show the little iTunes logo and the plus uh, cord sign, and it'll show the logo that's on the website that you can see right here. It says your jailbreaking is the jailbro jailbreak is done once the device reboots. If this was the simplest jailbreak ever, it was. So thank you to uh, this guy for making this jailbreak because it is really simple. <coughs> And all we're going to do now is wait for the device to reboot. Hey, by the way, guys, if you need any help with um, iPod Touches, I am on iPod Touch Fan Forums. That's iPodTouchFans.com slash forums. You can send me a message or whatever, or just on YouTube. I'm also on WebmasterWorld.com, so you can check me out on those websites. If you can't find me, make sure you just leave a, um, a post here on the forum. And really, somebody really uh, skilled will get back to you within a few minutes. It's really great. 
Um, so if you need any help jailbreaking or anything else, leave a comment on, the, on this video, send me a message, or find me on one of these forums, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Okay, once your device has rebooted and it's a uh, jailbroken state, then what you're going to want to do is open up uh, iTunes and right click on your device again and hit restore from backup. Now, I've already done this so you can't see mine, but um, that's what you're going to do and it will restore it and uh, you'll have your apps back again once you open up the program again and hit restore.